Hey, how's it going, Rob? Thanks for taking the time out of your day to watch this video that I made for you. Um, this is going to be an SEO analysis of your current website extreme mobile detailing. Um, it's really going to give you an idea of where you are on Google and can prospects find you if they need their car detailed or their RV or, or things of that nature, right? Um, so I just want to jump straight into the video. Uh, so as you can see, we're on one of my business pages. Uh, my company is Amp Local. Uh, we do SEO marketing, web design, PPC management, and lead generation. All right. So I'm going to cover some things that you probably already know about. I mean, you've been in the business for a while. You know what SEO is. You know how important it is to be on Google and things of that nature. Um, so as you can see, we're on your website. So 82% of the population are on Google. Um, whenever somebody needs uh, a product or a service, they're going to use Google. It's the most powerful and uh, popular way to extract information from the internet. All right. Um, so it has an algorithm. There's 200 determining factors. Um, I'm not going to get into all of those. I'm going to talk about four of the very most important ones. Um, if we nail when we nail these, everything else kind of falls into place. All right. And we kind of mentioned on the phone. I talked to you about you know having the phone number and the address in the city is a huge factor as well. Um, so, uh, so before I actually get into the algorithm, let me just take a step back. Um, how do we naturally find you on the internet, right? On Google. So usually you would type in, if I need my car detail, I'll put in auto detailing San Diego, or if I'm in San Diego, I would probably already type in just auto detailing or mobile auto detailing or car detailing, some of that nature, right? I'm sure you can test it us. Um, so one search I did, I did, uh, auto detailing San Diego. Um, again, if somebody was actually in San Diego, Google would know their location and they would just most likely pop in, uh, type in car detail and auto detail and it would pop up like this anyway. Um, so for you, you're not on the first page. Um, one of your top competitors from doing my analysis here is uh, Five Point Detail. I'm sure you know about them. Um, another one is uh, A and A Mobile Auto Detailing. Okay, that's two of your top competitors right now in, in Lee's Auto Detailing. Um, so for auto detail in San Diego, you were ranked on page eight, uh, number 71 right here. Okay. So it's really far back into the pages. Um, let's see another search I did. I did mobile auto detail in San Diego. We had a and a number one. Okay. And then you were actually, I think I have to click on it. It's uh, page three. If I remember correctly, <clears throat> let's see. Yep, right here, number three, I'm um, sorry, page three, number 27, right here, all right. So if you're not on page one, you might as well be on page 20. Now you are popping up on, um, you know, for other key searches, especially in Chula Vista, where you're located in a lot of that East Lake area or the um, Lakeside and El Cajon area, all that down south, you are popping on that. I'm not gonna show you, you already know that you're on the first page. Um, you obviously have built a very successful business, um, but obviously you wanna, take it to the next level so that's what we're doing um, so there you are on, on that page so next one I did R RV detail in San Diego um, you are popping up on this search uh, for number four all right so that's pretty good to be on that search for San Diego um, let's see RV repair San Diego that's another one you want me to look at you're not on the first page I don't think you're on the first few pages at all um, but uh, this guy right here um, my RV specialists rank number one for RV repairs. You said that's the direction that you want to be moving. Well, if you were him, um, this is how many clicks you'll be getting per month to your website. 1.3 thousand, which is huge. Um, there's a guarantee of 5% of those are closing through Google Analytics and statistics. Um, so this guy's making a lot of money um, by doing that. And I'm sure that he's ranked. He's got other SEO stuff going on or all around San Diego. Um, so that's where you want to be eventually. I just threw that in there real quick as a bonus. I wanted to show you that. Uh, but let me get back to comparing you to your auto detailers. Um, so let me show you some of the top keywords that these guys are, are ranking for. All right, Because one of the big things I'm going to talk to you about is uh, keyword research. All right, So for five point, um, they're, they're pulling 25% of their business from the keyword auto detailing. Okay, that's not too bad. They're ranked number five for that you were ranked number 71 okay so you definitely want to take some of that market um a and a 
mobile auto detailing, they're taking half, half of their business comes from mobile auto detailing. All right. And they were ranked number one. So 47% of the people that are going into that page are clicking on them. So that's huge. All right. And then uh, these, are, this is just, a, this is the keywords you're ranking for. You're ranking for 81% on motorcycle detailing and it's about 11% for RVT, RV detailing. So that's pretty interesting. Um, we definitely want to get your keyword research built uh, to reflect for mobile auto detailing and car detailing for sure. All right. So since I showed you those rankings and where you are and where your competitors are, I want to show you what the business looks like, exactly how many people go to your website. Okay. So if you're ranked number one, you're getting around 35 to 40% of the clicks. And as you saw, A and A mobile auto detailing, they're getting 47% of the clicks. So this, this data is getting better and better. People are wanting to click more and more on the high ranking individuals. All right. Um, if you're ranked number two, number three, number four, as you can see, it just kind of trickles down on how many clicks you get to your website. And then you're, if you're not on page one, like I said, you might as well be on page 20. All right. So definitely want to get you on page one for all your keywords and in, within the top three, so you can pull all that business. All right. Um, so more about keywords, uh, mobile auto detailing. It's a popular term. This is, this is, specifically for San Diego what I'm this keyword planner I'm using right here so it's showing you for the month month of March last year there was about 11,000 searches for mobile auto detailing not bad so if you if we had you ranked number one could you imagine how much traffic you'll be pulling um, and then look so mobile auto detailing averaging it averages you know per city 90 per month um, Car detailing, 360, I'm um, sorry, 390. So definitely these key terms are more popular than mobile auto detailing. So knowing that, I'm just kind of showing you what, what I do for my business. The reason why I'm so successful at what I do is because I'm able to reverse engineer the competition and figure out what they're ranking for and just do what they do and do more. Okay, so that's, that's just what I'm doing. I'm showing you the keywords that um, are going to be most popular that I'm going to build on your homepage, okay? Um, so... With all that being said, now I'm going to get to the algorithm, okay? Keyword research is a huge part of the algorithm. Now, the next four things I'm going to talk to you about are, is what Google takes very serious um, when it comes to the rankings, okay? Um, so the first thing I'm going to talk to you about is, um, actually, before I do that, sorry, I got more information on the clicks. Uh, so this is where you're at right now with your clicks, um, 131 clicks a month average. Um, and that's changing every month. Let's see. Sorry, I was like jumping, uh, jumping the gun here. Um, so you're about 131 clicks per month. If this thing loads, it'll give me a nice little picture. Okay, bam. So for February 1st from January, February 131, and it's kind of climbing up, you know, December, obviously it's going to drop off. So summertime, the sun's going to be out. People are going to be wanting more details. Um, one of your top competitors, Five Point, he's actually pulling 260. So twice he's getting twice the business as you right now, of you than you right now, all right. And he's his new, is doing the same thing. Um, his is climbing at a quicker rate, um, about a hundred more per month, all right. So definitely we want to get you taking that part of the market. We want that piece of the pie too, all right. So now let's get into the determining factors. Okay, the four things I want to talk to you about. First thing, authoritative content. All right. So it's very important on the home page that we build you authoritative content that is relevant to all of the services that you provide in San Diego. Okay. Mentioned many times and elaborated. Um, so we want to have 1,000 to 2,000 words on the home page. So if I go back to your home page real quick, you have some authoritative content, which is great. You're mentioning keyword cities. Um, you do have some keyword research in there. Um, but we need definitely need to beef it up. All right. And if you, you mentioned we were going to do a new website for, for you. So this whole website, it's awesome because you're not going to use your, lose your URL. We're going to keep your same URL. So all the work that's been put into it is going to remain. We're going to take this content, use it, all the media that you have, and we're just going to add more to it and make it look even more uh, professional and organized. Um, and especially Google and mobile friendly for sure. Um, so definitely want to build more keyword research right there and uh, authoritative content on the home page, all right? 
because that's what Google, Google wants to see that on the home page. All these service tabs and appointments and all that's great, but it's really all about the home page. All right. Um, you're, you're wondering why I had elephant here earlier. So I just wanted to show you, I typed an elephant on Google. Look what's number one, Wikipedia. They're notorious for popping up number one on these searches. Why? Because of the authoritative content. Look at this page. Endless amounts of information about elephants or habitat, the evolution, you know, what they eat, everything. Okay, their anatomy, uh, physiology, all that good stuff. So if I was writing a paper, I'd love to read this. I'm not going to read this, all right? So that's like 50,000 words. We're, talk we're only talking about 1,000 to 2,000. I just wanted to give you an idea of what that looked like. Next, citations. We also call these um, business listings, all right? So some examples, um, Google. Yahoo, Facebook, Bing, Yelp, Yellow Pages, White Pages, MapQuest. Um, super important. Uh, have, when we do them, we have to have the business name, address, and phone number identical because if not, Google is going to slap us down. Um, so even though you are popping up in some key terms on the first page and some of the other cities, you know, you're pulling a good, good amount of leads for your business. But if we're going to go to the next level, this is something we definitely got to take serious and get it fixed and get it done right. 80% excuse me, 86% error rate. Okay. Um, definitely want to go through here. I'm going to go through here and make sure all of these are identical. It's saying that you're not Google verified, which concerns me. Um, so we definitely want to make sure that your business is Google verified so that we can get you in the maps section. Um, I can also, so that, uh, clients can also leave your reviews on there too. Um, so speaking on reviews, uh, part of what I can do is I can get you legitimate, uh, five-star reviews. Uh, we can talk more about that later, um, but I have a great way that I'm able to do that. Um, so yeah, so here's the list of the top 50 in the country. Definitely want to get you listed in here, all like your information. There's thousands of these, um, but we want to consistently be adding these on a consistent basis monthly, okay, um, and get you in the hundreds, okay, over time, and we want to space it out so Google doesn't think anything's going on, right? So that's citations. Next, let me talk to you about backlinks, okay? So say you have a client thoroughly impressed with their detail, which I'm sure happens all the time. Um, say they have a website or they're a blogger or write articles or something like that and they post it on the internet. What will happen is they'll actually post an article about your website or about your business um, and then put the website so anybody reading the article can click on the website and go to your web page. Now you have a new prospect. More importantly, Google sees this as a vote. So the more votes you have, the more likely you're going to win the top positions in Google and for the organic rankings, right? It's just like running for president. Whoever has the most votes wins. This is the voting process, all right? Now, you're probably asking yourself, how are we going to get you all these links? Okay, let me, let me talk to you about these numbers. So as you can see, across the board, all your numbers are pretty low. So let me explain them to you. Referencing domains. This is how many websites on the Internet right now that's mentioning you, okay? Three backlinks. That means there's two websites referencing your website three times, okay? That's all that means. And then these two numbers, trust flow and citation flow, trust flow is the quality of these domains. This number ranges from zero to 100. Citation flow is, is how often is this happening? So at 16, it's, it means that it's not happening often. All right, let me show you this chart. So this is your trust flow quality meter okay you're at zero right now okay so you're meeting low quality websites all right competitor competitors they're up in the medium to high quality or trust flow of 20 15 to 20 range okay so what's phenomenal about doing business with me is that i can actually i have unlimited amounts of publishable high quality domains that we can reference your website on um, I've written so many articles. I've written articles on uh, how the Air Force refuels their C-130s to, uh, you know, the, the the CVs and the Navy rebuilding schools to um, volunteer events in San Diego. Like you name it, it doesn't matter what the website is about or what the article is about, as long as we anchor text or link your website in that article to a word that is mentioned on your homepage. Or we can put the whole URL on the home page and show that it's a website URL and someone could just click on it. We'll say this article is sponsored by so-and-so. So this is how we get you your votes. Sound good? All right. So that's backlinks. Um, the last thing I want to talk to you about. 
being mobile friendly. So as you already know, you are not mobile friendly. We already talked about that. We're going to get you a new Stellar website built that's Google and mobile friendly and get you in the top searches. All right. But I just wanted to show you this. Um, you know, this is definitely something Google takes serious and looks at. It's one of the top determining factors. So I just want to throw this in here. You already know you're not mobile friendly. Um, so, you know, 60 to 80 percent of the population actually use their iPhone or Android or mobile device to find a product or service in the area. So you've got to look good on the device. And again, like I said, Google takes it very, very serious. All right. So that is about it for my SEO analysis for your website. Um, this There's a huge potential for you to, to grow this business. Um, as far as the RVs and everything and, and my lead generation, I'm looking at the list of cities that you got right now. It's about 12, 11 or 12. Um, so you are popping, like I said, on some of the, the top cities, some of those cities for RV um, and detailing. Um, but when I show you the chart, I mean, you're usually, you're popping around like number three and lower. So if we got you to number two and number one, I mean, you could triple your business in those cities. And then if we built you out uh, lead generation websites, that's just going to pretty much just take more of the pie. It's all about just how, how much there's a pie and how much of it do you want? You know, so that the lead generation sites, that's what it does. You know, and when I focus um, every all my SEO into building that one site in that one area, mentioning only that one area and the services that you provide. Um, that's how we're gonna. That's how we get the top um, areas and and um, and just truly dominate. So before I let you go, I actually you mentioned you wanted to see um, one of the sites. Um, so instead of just shooting you a link and letting you just do whatever, I actually wanted to explain and show you my site. So I kind of got a little portfolio I paused it for a second and um, pulled up just some of my work uh, so you can see um, so this is keyword limo bus Escondido so this is a limo and party bus website um, that I built a lead gen site for Escondido um, this thing is pulling like 200 leads a month um, and I'm sending the leads down to a uh, a business um, in San Diego so as you can see it's number one right here in the maps this is the, this is the name of it Escondido's premier party bus rental um, and then I have it number two right here um, in the organics so it's it's moving up you know pr relatively quick it's I, I see it here you know probably in a couple weeks um, but this thing's pulling tons of leads um, it's ridiculous how much those guys are making um, next uh, let's see this is yeah this San Diego auto connection in uh, the Mission Valley's auto circle um, I'm doing their SEO right now uh, when I first took them on they weren't even on the one page at all for anything um, so now right here page uh, page one number two in the in the uh, maps also their stars um, they were a three-star business before 3.0 they had like 20 reviews and um, I did mention earlier, I can get reviews, legitimate reviews for Google and Yelp. Um, so now he's a four star with 52 reviews. So bam. Um, and then he's number three right here for all of San Diego. All right. And that's just one hot. This is one of the hot keywords. Um, he's ranking in many of the keywords. Same thing with my other party bus website. I just wanted to shoot you an example real quick. Uh, what else did I pull up? Uh, medical equipment, San Diego. Okay. That's my... Uh, Harmony Home Medical, they're in uh, actually located just north of here, I think close to La Jolla, but they're San Diego. Um, I got them in, they're ranked number three right here in the maps. So they're pulling a, a chunk of that pie and then they're ranked right three right here in the uh, organic. So pulling, they're pulling a lot of business. I mean, that's just one example. They're ranking for like medical supply and medical home installation, some other stuff that they got going on. All right. All right. So here's some actual websites that I put together myself. So this is a construction business, Olympic construction here in San Diego. They're actually out of Encinitas, but they were like, I want San Diego all over my stuff. So they're, they're, we're getting them ranked for San Diego. Um, so this is an example of just a site that I did. You know, we got them a video, um, just some keyword research, you know, different stuff about the business. So, um, you know, nothing too complicated. They wanted it straight to the point. Um, these, uh, these are their projects. You click this, it goes to their projects, and then you click on the pictures, you know, and it just takes you to 
all of the uh, different things that they did. So, I mean, there's so many things that we could do for your websites. Um, it's, it's endless. You just let me know, kind of have an idea what you want and I can make it happen. Um, th yeah, this is my Escondido party bus website, uh, lead generation. So it's really built, especially on a mobile device. It looks great on a mobile device. It's really built to get the phone ringing right away. So as soon as somebody hits it, the phone number is here, instant quote, phone number again, you know, Yelp, Google reviews, you can click them, it goes straight to them, fill out the form, bam, fill out your information, get them to give you information, you know, and just got some pictures. Um, this is built like this on the left side because whenever somebody were to look at it on their phone, it's um, mobile friendly. Um, so we'll see all this information first and then it still looks pretty good for a web page. So um, yeah, this is the one that's generating about at least, at, they get at least 200 uh, a month. Last last month, I think they hit uh, just over 200. This month is going to be a lot more than that. Uh, what else did I get? Uh, so this is Lovely Nights Limousine, um, redid their website, um, they were like page five of, five or six of Google, um, and actually, I didn't even pull, so I'll show you where they're at now, um, so this is a web redesign, so keyword research, built some content, got some good pictures, um, you know, I got their fleet here, so, you know, just another idea of what we can do for you. I know before and after is great for auto detailing, so we could set up something like that. Um, let me see real quick, where are they? Party bus, Party bus San Diego. So that they were on like page six before. I think they're on, not on one yet. They're not quite on one yet. I think they're on two. So which is huge. I mean, they're moving on up. I've only been with them for. Uh, just we're going on our second one now. Bam, right there. So they're at the bottom of page two now. So I mean, they're making huge adjustments. Everything I'm adding to them every month is just bumping them up. Um, I think this month we'll definitely get them, if not on the bottom of one, definitely at the top of two. And then next, the following month, they'll already be there. So they're going to be generating a lot of business just from that. All right. So that's everything I wanted to show you. Um, yeah. So. I'm writing a proposal as you're watching this, um, so let's chat later. I know that all of this makes sense for your business. Um, I appreciate the time that you put into me, and I know you, you appreciate the time I put into you, so um, I hope that we can come to an agreement. I really look forward to doing business with you. Um, and I, like I said, I wanted to make this video because I really like being as transparent as I possibly can because the money that you invest in your business is it's it's a lot of money you know so i want to make sure that you know where that money's going um everything i do i do report uh generate reports every month so you can track your progress um all the links and all the citations and all that stuff i was mentioning you know i, I can send you an electronic copy you can click it and go verify it on the internet and see your business information so everything's clean cut you know upfront transparent so that's that's how i like to keep it um, again, thank you for your time, Rob, and I'll be talking to you soon. Have, uh, have a good night.